Who's the most successful influencer by Jubilee? I hate the word influencer. And I'm almost definitely even less popular than whoever the least popular influencer is in this. That's going to be a bit depressing because they're obviously going to be like, oh, you only have, what, 10k followers? How, how pathetic. Meanwhile, I have by, what, 10 big subs? But let's get into the video. Same appearance. They aren't allowed to mention yearly hard drinks until we find out what? They, were, what? they had to be actively stopped from telling that they're million. Who are these people? Man? Like, you, give me, you give me so like bougie looks. I'll put you in the front. I agree. I agree. That's a cool I put in the front. But I reckon she looks like an eagle. Twitch streamer, almost. Definitely. That's probably in top, top three. Then, this guy just looks like the most basic Minecraft YouTuber I could ever get. think of. He's like 480p worth and everything. Then I couldn't. Everyone else just looked quite. But they could be any. Who else? Uh, let me. You know what? Let me put an order. Ooh. The third. I reckon she's second. He is third. This one on the left is first. One, two, three. She's fourth. He's fifth. She's sixth. And she's seventh. It based on nothing. I have no clue who these people are or what they could possibly do. That, that's all I have. Yeah. yeah. I'm gonna shoot down like I disagree. I personally believe you probably make $1 billion dollars. <laughs> I agree. I was going to say the same thing. It's he gets to be maybe gamer. Yeah. Yes. I'm going to put him in the middle. He's still so mentally here for me. Oh, shit. I feel like your that. shoes, Rhea, are kind of expensive. I can't tell if it's like a knockoff of quality platforms. They're usually like $200 to $300. You give me like, um, you have like a million followers on Instagram and you do like model shoots every single day, like fashion shoots. Mm. <laughs> I want to put her in the middle. What's your name? Over you say more than shoots and put her in the middle. You, you make a lot of money like selling cookies if you're nice. <laughs> <laughs> or like sweaters on Etsy or like something. Sweet, very sweet. Yeah, very good. Yes. And you have a funny TikTok. TikTok. So I think you are like over here. Over here, yeah. I like this. That's I more it. than the mortar. What? This yeah. list makes no sense. No sense. I'm cool with this too. You think this makes sense? Really? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna disagree. I think Rhea should be one more ahead. Okay. I would put Josh like further on a point. Maybe you can tell if he has like a secret a million dollars. Why the hell is he six? Yeah, maybe between you. Yeah, I agree. I would be good right here. Josh, oh, no, Josh, come no, on, Josh. Come Josh, on. where's your sweater from? H&M. H&M, okay. Um, so H&M's like a classic though. Like, I know a lot of guys who wear like only H&M, but they make good money. Well, it's because like a lot of girls are yeah, fashionable, yeah. but, but they're wearing like a thousand dollar shoes. Yeah. True. So, I don't hate this lineup. Yeah. yeah. I, I kind of think it's... You think this is the lineup? They started out saying that he's the guy on the Making TikTok videos about like tech reviews and tech stuff. Oh, that's money. I run yeah. multiple businesses from it. What kind Ooh. of tech businesses? Like can laptops, computers? Money, like, money. On keyboards, I make like custom ones. Um, and I also am getting yeah, like, like, clothes, so that is not study. I feel like you're great with Everything money, so okay. even if you maybe technically didn't like bring in as much as some other of us a couple years ago, you maybe have grown it more because you're probably very smart. I'm sure you're investing. Ooh. I feel like you absolutely I think need to up. up. How many TikTok accounts do you have? Three. That have done well. You should second. take my spot. I'm mean, scary over second, here. Third. Yeah, second. I would. I would put you like second. Let's do second. Tech is a lot. I put in Plus, third. you have all those other income streams on top of it. Yeah. yeah. So I teach people how to be what? content creators, but I'm also a Twitch streamer. Ah. Of course. Shock. So that comes. Yes. Oh wait, she what? She runs an influencer course. 
I don't like that. Uh, I don't. I don't sell I've seen so many of those shit. Because obviously, I have a hundred subscribers. I've seen way too many of them. Because I believe in like I get emails so much so people, so, so I don't like paywalling info. How do you make oh, it from um, without that? Fan. Yeah. So I get two dollars and fifty cents for every sub that I get. That's like one way that oh, I make please, my money. Yeah. And TikTok sponsorships yeah. mainly, and I also have like Instagram and YouTube and stuff, but they're like really small. And those are two pretty lucrative platforms. But also, you have a lot of morals, which makes me think you don't make as much money. <laughs> you haven't sold your soul. Bad. Yeah, I mean that with the LA rent rising though. <laughs> I still yeah. don't think you should be last, though. Like, I don't feel like she should move until we hear a couple more. Yeah, yeah, I would keep myself down I here. Really like, <laughs> bring her here. <laughs> uh, so I do a few different things. Uh, um, my big one is I am a sex educator. So I host a podcast. I we just launched that. the third season. So I've been doing that since 2019. Uh, and I do sex education content on my Instagram as well as on my TikTok. And I also okay. upload all the podcast episodes to my YouTube channel. Ooh. Hmm. I mean, that. YouTube's not going to be very big because you get demonetized for anything. But it, I don't think she'll be first. Well, YouTube, 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 YouTube. But my my one caveat mm. is sex education, which in terms of making money through sponsorships, it's not harder. many companies would want. Yeah. to Fortunately, work uh -huh. with the sex educator. Even though I think it's like a cool. And thing. it's harder to get ad revenue because yeah. um, I'm constantly you know working Shadow through bands and mm -hmm. things like that. You are making most of your money though. Through all of those, as well as OnlyFans. Oh, but OnlyFans makes money. Yeah. Uh, that's mm. money. OnlyFans has such a yeah, money. Yeah. Money. Yeah. first. Up here. Third. Third. Top three for sure. Yeah. Okay. All right. So uh, I make like content just around like money and I try and teach Gen Z uh, good like money habits with short little funny videos. Finance makes so much money because not only do they push it but you also get so many sponsorships especially yeah, on YouTube. Exactly. Are you on YouTube or are you on YouTube? What is it? It, it goes like in this order of TikTok, Instagram, YouTube stuff. I feel like those videos also mm -hmm. especially in the way you do them with comedy are super... I know because of an old villainy video that finance YouTube have by far the best CPM. So he could be top three. I would put you up because definitely you finance. Yeah. Finance is such a lucrative niche. I'm, I'm okay with that. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, yeah. Okay, I am a TikToker. I knew it. <laughs> I knew I could tell. <laughs> but I really mostly TikTok fashion first. stuff, like secondhand fashion, vintage stuff, and <laughs> lifestyle. What do you sell? Uh, I don't really anymore. I started like my TikTok promoting my online vintage shop, and that's how I became a TikToker. Then I'm fine with uh, being like last yeah, or second, last yeah. order. So your revenue comes from sponsors. Yeah, it's like all social media now. I don't know. Fashion makes like no money that's unless true. you're a thin white woman. So, <laughs> so uh, she's a thin white woman. So being plus size in the social ooh. media industry is definitely been hard. There's visibly fat plus size people and then there's people with the quintessential perfect curves like almost unfortunately how plus size are you if you do lifestyle but you're a small creator you get nothing like they yeah, literally yeah. only gifting yeah. campaigns and then like even then they gaslight you into feeling like you should be grateful for it yeah but absolutely. given i'm guessing you sound like you're a very large creator and then like i feel like i've seen your videos on my free page i would maybe put you first oh don't do that yes. i'm also this is like my first what? year doing this Oh. Yeah, I okay, say, I know anyone right sizes. here. I don't me. think I make more than you. We, we still have time to switch. So. Let's try. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, so I um, am a plus size supermodel, so everything I do is pretty much lifestyle around that. And it's been my full time yeah. job for about four years now. I have my own cannabis and sexual wellness podcast, so I do that podcast. separately. I also have my own consultation. the case that if you want to have coaching business where I teach aspiring plus size models. So I have an online course that's a master class that I do quarterly. And then I also have a blog separately that's that I. Nice. Post on one, at least once a week and the ad marketing is just starting on my blog so it's oh, not they don't too far in there but i'm very familiar with ad marketing and revenue have a, a lot i will put you first absolutely. like just, yeah you have absolutely. so many streams of income, so many of income. Yeah. you just seem very very knowledgeable and what about you kasumi i do really? only fans i also do youtube i also do instagram um my main stream of income though is tiktok not specifically ad revenue but i make like seven and, ten TikToks, and i just like 
like pump out Hold as it. many reels of me as I a can. Day? Yes, with wow. different Crazy. with different captions, and I just lead it back to my OnlyFans. But I do I make a lot of memes. That's like my kind of like niche. I make. Oh. Do you have a billboard in WeHo? <laughs> yeah, I do. Oh. I do have a billboard in WeHo. Oh, that's sick. Okay. Yeah. Do you that's take sponsorships? No, I'm a sex worker. How do you so, make them tell you that? Sponsors don't want Pentagon sign up. Face working. Billboard. Look at it. <laughs> what the hell? Look at it. Yeah, I do. I do have a billboard in WeHo. <laughs> I saw that. Yeah. Do you take sponsorships? No, I'm a sex worker, so they don't. Sponsors don't want me or my face to represent their brand. The only reason I get away with that is because I also am so a creator. Like, yeah, I completely understand the second they hear that you have any sort of like OnlyFans or sex work. Yeah, and I've gone and deleted like seven times. Yes. Yeah. Where do you rank? Mm. Like what's your percentage on OnlyFans? I'm 0.01%. Surely you can okay. say that. Alright, what? Well, number one. <laughs> <laughs> number one. Switch. Absolutely. Yeah, fair enough. How many guys have you been with? Um, I used to do parties and I would get like 50 dudes a night okay, so you're on no jumper yeah. yeah that's the kind of video that goes Madness. viral i mean there's yeah there's no doubt about that video has millions of views so my photo is a photo of me in vogue um <gasps> that so i'm it's a beautiful photo my butt's in vogue does vogue pay a lot it's almost kind of like like being a playboy centerfold in a sense of like it's an honor okay congrats on your new baby insert cash or select Ooh. Sonic to show a comedy tip that is not going to be good. If they don't laugh, it's shit. What? The average cost of childbirth and pregnancy <laughs> care in the U.S. is $6,940 with health insurance or $13,000 without. And it can vary wildly. What's your change my mind. What's your return policy like? <laughs> <laughs> this is my dad. And yeah. this is his at-home work setup. He hates it. So today, I'm going to try to fix it. Mm -hmm. I'm going to first add a custom keyboard I built for him and a mouse. He's and got that most of his type. Okay. Not good videos. Fast talking. Oh, and my hands. To the camera. Making sure to fucking stare at it. Everything. He's got it down to a D. He definitely is. Let's see. 3, 4 million TikTok followers. At least. Sweater a little bit and make it a little more me. Wait, here they are. As you can see, that's I need so to be a little cute. bit taller for these, and I think it would be a crime not to wear these. <gasps> Wait, I love the fit. Yeah. That's pretty much what I Oh my god, Got that's it. so cute. Our noses smushed up against our kissing partner's face is actually opening up our nostrils and making their pheromones more obvious to us. What? And whether you realize it or not, your body will actually react to that person's pheromones and can make you more attracted to them if your body thinks yeah, you're good. Yeah, definitely getting I can end it to a lot of people. Good biological match. I was kidding. That's woke. Best websites for Twitch streamers. Twitch Tracker is a website uh, that tracks stuff. your stream. There are so data. many people It'll show you the stuff. max viewers, follower gains, and the amount of hours you stream per stream. They also have a very nice graph showing your average viewer count and the amount you streamed. And cool stats like average viewer count per day. Yeah, so that's like driving. similar to the type of content I do. Oh. I feel like mm. I should go down in the tech men. I feel the like tech men should I want to up. put, I think your name is Teddy, right? Yes. You second, because I saw that, I saw that ad. Tech pays well. That ad was really well edited. I'm mm. pretty sure companies will see that. Yeah. And be like, I want, I'm going to go and sponsor you. I'll put you second. I put you second, yeah. Where did I put you second or third? I'm okay where I'm at. Um. Oh, 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 find a case. Hmm. Oh, what? She has 715k on YouTube as a sex educator. That's, that's very impressive. Facebook. Who the hell is Facebook? What? 42k on Twitch. To be honest, I would have expected a lot more than 450k on TikTok. But everyone, TikTok for us, I think that is translatable. 690k for him, 306k for him, but he's got an active audience because they're also on his Insta. She doesn't as much. She, I mean, YouTube to be fair, that, that is only an active audience. And I mean, she's a model, so like, it doesn't really matter that.
you guys feel like numbers, like the follower count matters? No. Oh, hell no. Absolutely, Absolutely not. not. One thing I'd like to say is like quality depending on the industry work. you're in because I have a There's friend who has a quadruple yeah, following I do and 10 times the engagement and I make three times as much as she does because of the quality and I sell usage rights so people can use it as ads. Yeah, yeah, I think, yeah, I think, I think, I think. Yeah, I would buy you second. Yeah, me yeah. Yeah. How many hours do you guys work? I work every day. A lot. Like this week I worked like four 18 hour days at minimum. There's no day where I'm working le like almost every single day where I'm working less than five hours. At least. I'm not trying to diminish what they were saying. Like it is hard work. And like, but she's talking about like, oh, like work doesn't end, but like, it's like, it does. You can go get a movie and like, sit in your bed and scroll emails. It's not the same as like being expected to be somewhere and like be a slave all day, be off your phone. Like you're not a person when you're at work. Like you're a person when you're doing this job. It's hard to, when you do a job like this, because at first I was like, oh, I don't actually, you know, work that many hours. But then it's like the second I wake up, I'm checking and I'm deciding what I'm gonna do yeah, that day. And the actually second I actually go to bed. All the day. Yeah. 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 So how do you decide for what's Yeah, so it's not. hard when you're not doing it. Like I'm maybe not working four hours straight because I'll stop and I'm, I have the privilege of being able to grab lunch with friends or yeah. shop in the middle of the day or like do whatever. I do, but that doesn't mean I'm not constantly, you know, mm -hmm. yeah. working in some capacity. And then, like, so we can still exist. Right, exactly. Yeah. 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 There's really no days off. How is your come up? Because I started with gaming content and then I transitioned into education. I did too. Like, when, oh my God, love gaming. But, um, like, especially as like a female gamer who was trying to do content, I got memed on so much. Everyone's like, oh my God, you're such an e girl. Like, yeah, a, like, ABG e girl, e girl. I didn't, I didn't tell that, did I? Aesthetic, haha, you suck at the game anyway. Well, and now it's in. in. Dude, and now I, it's like, I know, and now it's cool, right? What year were you doing that? I was doing it in like, 2018, 2019. Yeah. I was doing it in 2011. Oh, what? To be a female okay. YouTuber in a male dominated space in 2011 was traumatizing. Brutal. I have a question for you, Josh. Do you feel like you have to work harder or um, fight for what you're worth as a black man? I don't know if I necessarily have to fight harder, but it is a little bit <laughs> harder to. I mean. <laughs> I don't want to get people to take you seriously. I mean, he's, a, co he's a company. I signed with like a management as agency. As I could tell. Be that only I, I don't think that's... Oh, okay. I love that. You know, it just feels like a... I mean, know, there are quite a few. Absolutely. And, you know, I know that they're like out there fighting to they're get like what's team. best for yeah, me. Yeah, okay. absolutely. They've been so helpful because I've run into other black creators that have like my similar following and a similar niche. I mean, they're earning way less and there's so much more money out there that they're just not getting mostly because they don't know exactly what they're worth. I don't know. Yeah. This looks like it makes sense. I feel yeah. like it doesn't. I feel like I need to go uh, I down wanna, one I want to move down. I feel like with the YouTube AdSense, maybe I'll switch this. I think we should, maybe. We should switch. Okay, but I want to I want to say this though. I have I have a modeling agency, and eighty percent of the work that I get I get myself. It's more about him getting one. I don't feel the need for one because I don't think I'm getting as many maybe as he is. Interesting. That's just my really? take. Yeah, that, that's not this so all the numbers. And then I guess it's he way way better. What's your second biggest channel again? It's for my business and it has seventy five thousand. I have employees and I don't really do anything. Oh, so I really don't think I should be here. I think he needs you to be a second. Oh, His employees? I feel like I just want to move myself in, in between, between us. Right, 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 right. How do we feel about this? this? Yeah, this looks like our final answer. I'm okay, good. good with this. Ooh, ooh. Seven, spot, tiny. Huh? What? What? I'm feeling he spends a lot of it. Okay. Uh, last. No I mean, last is a hundred and fifteen k. Six figure five. Six spot. Henry is fucking rich, though. Fourth spot. That Twitch money. But wait, I like, like three. My three and my top four are at the last. What the heck? I fucked this up badly. Grace, 180k. And the I put it last third spot, Josh, 275k. I knew you were um, up here. And in the second spot, Rhea, 300k. Wow. And the first I, I don't think I got anyone correct. Yeah. Three million. Three million. Sex worker? Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Spare W. Yeah, that only sounds good. We're talking about it. Thanks. Oh, that's Three million. <laughs>
ten times as fast. Yeah, that can even fit. Yeah, let's go. Fair <laughs> I trust. Retire tomorrow. <laughs> madness. Actual madness. I mean, to be fair, they didn't get much right either. On our parents, actually, they were completely close in terms of these two. And she has been first all throughout. As soon as they heard only a fancy book, that's straight to the top. Shock. Then, what else? He has been fairly consistent. Yeah, I'm reached out. She has ended up a lot lower than they thought. And she is all, I mean, actually, yeah, she is in the average of where they expected. I do that. People uh, hate when you make a lot of money in a non traditional way, and they really hate when you make it off sex work. Yeah. So I was very, very mm. nervous about. The reaction. I am an anomaly and I don't represent what all sex workers make. I make a lot of money, but it is still something that you should deeply consider before getting into because it is something that has holds a lot of social stigma and does make life hard if you don't like doing it. And uh, I just want to say that y'all have motivated me because I feel like I became like comfortable with what I was doing and like I haven't been pushing myself recently, but now I'm like. Oh, they're doing so well. I'm like, well, that's crazy. You woke up and made a whole website by yourself. Oh, oh, that took me like three months on my blog to do. Yeah, when I was 19, I was homeless. So I am really proud of you and whatever you've done and the fact that you can have a hundred k and so many cool things every year. I think there's an idea of what an influencer is in people's heads, and I think it's usually like a airheaded person who just takes selfies or uses a selfie stick. They don't understand. I think maybe the nuance. Like I was kind of weird coming into it because I. I grew up really poor and like $180,000 is like so much money. I mean, it is. I like, I would be happy making the amount of money I make right now for the rest of my life. And I feel like everyone gets into it and they're like, I have to be a millionaire and I have to like monetize every category of my life. And that's probably where it becomes like an insane job. Yes. Pretty good video. I did not guess that correctly. Damn. The rich boy. The rich boy game. I was not rich. Or in comparison. $115,000 a year. At 19, it's still fucking minted. But at the end of the day, only fans beat Sasha. That's all we learned from this idea.